In this video I'm showing how to fix an issue with VMware Player where the install VMware tools option is grayed out. I ran into this problem a few times with Windows 7 and Server 2008 VMs so maybe it's something just specific to the older software. But what I found is that this issue seems like it's caused by the install media tying up the CD drive somehow. One way I found to fix it is to close out of everything and then shut down the VM. and then go back into VMware Tools. My VM that I'm working on is the top one here. What I'm gonna do is edit virtual machine settings and for the CD drive, I'm gonna change it to use the physical drive instead of the ISO that I used to install. I don't actually have a physical drive on my machine, but this seems to work anyways. It just gives a weird error message. So go ahead and hit okay and then restart the VM. And this is that error message, it's just complaining because there's not actually a device plugged in and it's asking if we want to connect this every time. I'm going to go ahead and say no. Okay, so now with the VM booted back up, I'm going to go ahead and close out of these windows here. And if I go back to computer, we can see that the ISO with the Server 2008 installer is no longer mounted. I'm going to click on player and then go to manage and you can see install VMware tools is now available. I'm going to go ahead and click on that. And from that point, it's just a normal install. I can double click on this and run through the installer just like normal. Alright, so that's pretty much it for this video. Hit like if it helped you out, and thanks for watching.